really pleased with the strike rate here. This is one of the clovers that I cast, seeds I cast. This is sunfoil that I seed I cast. This is salad burnet. You can see all three of them are a three-leafed um, seedling. The leaves of these will extend and be longer. These will be on a stem of three leaves and then clovers will remain like clovers. This is one of the clovers. I think this is one of the white clovers. But um, here's some more sunfoil and salad burnet. You can see the baby greens of those. But there's loads of them in here. There, there's some dandelions. That's some purple clover there. So it's all through these leaves, the grasses, the, the, these other plants are coming up, these seedlings, more sandfoil, salad burnet. In here, there's some more clovers, salad burnets. And look at all these little clovers coming up. And the grasses are looking lovely as well. So I'm very pleased with the strike rate in here of the grass, clover, sandfoil, Vetches should be coming up as well, but they're not as distinguishable as sandfoil and salad burnet and the clovers yet. Here's some more of the clovers. But there will be vetches and all those things coming up as well, hopefully. So I'm very pleased with this. This is fantastic. Really, really lovely. And here's yarrows coming up. This is this is yarrow. These fern-like things are yarrows. Here's a um, uh, plantain that I sowed here as well. So good variety. Looking great. Sheep's parsley. Here's sheep's parsley was in, in the mix. So excellent, excellent um, strike rate. This is going to really improve this field. Okay, it's only from this electric fence here, only here, to that fence there. But each little bit counts when you've got a small acreage. I'm about to release the horses, so they're going to come galloping along here and go down over there. Their section is where they're going to graze. You can see they've grazed patches all the way along, slowly but surely fertilizing and improving the land. It's about farming with nature so that both me, the farmer, and nature get the most out of the land.